Hey YouTube, it's Audrey, and I'm here to share with you this week's project for the Cutting Cafe design team. This week we had a theme of home, and we had two files to choose from. There is a Welcome Home printable snap set that has all kind of sentiments and different things that you could use. And then the one that I chose to use is the house shape card set um, and it does also come with an envelope envelope so um, before you is my project and I decided to um, play around a little bit with my silhouette studio software and I tried a new technique for this particular one I actually used the fill um, Check the fill button in the studio where you could fill a shape with a pattern or with a color. So the red here on the roof line and in the window and in the door were filled with solid um, coloring and then the house was filled with this yellow polka dot pattern. So that was something that I had not done and I filled each shape and I placed them and then I um group them all together in the in the software and then I just sent it to the printer and it printed it out on my regular printer. I cut it out by hand but I could have also cut it out with the Cameo after I sent it because you're able to do that with the print and cut feature that comes um, with studio software. So um, I think it came out pretty good. I will be definitely using that technique in the future. And I saw it on a video, somebody, I think it might have been um, Sean Wash showed how to do that, I believe. So um, watching other people's videos definitely helps me learn um, what can be done with the Silhouette Cameo because I haven't had it for that long. Then I added my own touches. Um, for the shingles, I used some paper from Teresa Collins and I cut out three fourth inch circles with a circle punch and I edged them in black um, chalk ink to give them a little definition and then I just layered them on top of each other. So um, I think that came out a really, really cute. I like what it added, the little texture that it adds to the house. And then I just added a gray, solid gray chimney. And then I used a um, candy dot for the door handle. And then I used my Martha Stewart drippy goo, I think it's called, punch, to make what looks like, not really grass, but maybe bushes here at the bottom of the house line. And then I used, I printed out, an address and it's 40 new age lane and then I cut it out with my tag punch and this card is for my cousin who will actually be home for her 40th birthday um, she has lived in many different places as her husband was in the military for quite a while and they lived in um, London and then now they have moved permanently to Huntsville Alabama so um, her birthday is coming up and she will actually be home on her birthday. So I thought, wow, this week will work perfectly for that um, because it's the first time that she'll be home and it is for her um, big 4-0. And on the inside, I just put a sentiment that says, glad you're home for your big 4-0. Happy birthday. And then I just cut out spellbinder shapes to um, include on the inside. But I think the card is really, really cute. There are so many different things that you could do with it. And I just want to point out that each of these pieces comes separately. So you can cut them out by hand. I just decided to try something a little different with the print and cut feature on um, the Cameo. But keep in mind that all files from the Cutting Cafe do come in PDF. So you do not need to have a cutting machine to... Um, actually complete the files I did most of my files by hand until recently when I did get a cameo so um, don't feel intimidated or think that you can't get the files simply because you do not have an electronic cutting machine because that isn't the case 
I do want to remind you guys that it's Inspiration Wednesday. That means that there are new projects from the design team that will be on the Cutting Cafe's blog later on this afternoon. So make sure that you go on over there, look at all the projects, and be sure to leave a comment because when you do, you are entered into a drawing for the next week. Regina always pulls one name a week and that person gets to pick three files of their choice from um, the Cutting Cafe. So as always, thank you for watching. And if you want to see some close-up um, photos of the roof and um, the other elements of the card, please head on over to my blog, which is SoGoodCrafter.com. Thank you so much for watching, and you guys have a great and very blessed day.